This is Bob Fitrakis bringing you the Trust Vote Report. A lot of things happening, and uh, you'll hear my argument on why the primary election should be postponed in Ohio. As I sit here, Friday the 13th, the bad news is pouring in, and uh, this morning's New York Times reports that they are triaging, that's right, a war term, to let the worst of, uh, of the population die. They are triaging in northern uh, Italy, reports of possible mass graves in Iran. The coronavirus is reaching its peak here in Ohio. How bad is it? All the schools are closed, including the colleges. They just closed the courts. Uh, the federal court is operating under emergency contingent status, and they've closed the county common pleas and municipal courts. So uh, we're in the middle of an unprecedented crisis in our lifetime, and what needs to be done is the primary needs to be postponed in Ohio. Uh, let me tell you why. First of all, there's a tremendous problem. Hundreds of poll workers uh, are backing away from working uh, on Tuesday. The state is now trying to pressure state employees to go and work. But they've already closed all the colleges in Ohio. Uh, this is a tremendous disadvantage uh, for Bernie Sanders, who's running. His core base of support uh, is among college students. Not only have the dormitories in the college residence been closed, the students have been ordered to leave. And under Ohio law, uh, many of them live in other counties. Uh, it's too late. Well, actually, the uh, deadline uh, is tomorrow. But if you get an absentee ballot, there's no way it's going to be mailed in uh, or you risk it by the deadline. There's no way for the Sanders forces to get that word out. Uh, I know I've talked to various uh, representatives of the Sanders campaign, but uh, in order for them to vote, Say you live in Athens County and you go to Ohio State, the, the polls on campus are closed. The residency halls, uh, the apartments run by the college, all closed. And you can't stay there. So the only way to vote is to go to the County Board of Election on 1700 Morris Road. Uh, but many people aren't going to do that. I can give you the hours, but uh, many people are avoiding crowds. Uh, 8 to 7 today, Friday, 8 to 4 Saturday, 1 to 5 on Sunday, but 8 to 2 on Monday. But if you're out of county, it's not likely as a college student you're going to drive back in uh, and the students at Ohio State are from all over the state. Same thing's true at Ohio University in Athens, Bowling Green, Kent State, Toledo. Uh, Jason Edwards, a consultant and field worker for the uh, Bernie campaign, has written the Secretary of State and the governor demanding that the primary be postponed until April. Uh, there's no way to run a functional primary uh, when virtually the entire state of Ohio, its courts, its K-12 through schools, its libraries, uh, and all the uh, colleges and universities are shut down, and there's a ban on meetings larger than 100 people. Uh, this is a tragedy, and one that disproportionately impacts the Sanders campaign. So, uh, and uh, oddly, there's been some criticism. The Democratic Party regulars 
uh, that pass out the sample ballot for the Franklin County uh, party are still at work, uh, hopefully not spreading the coronavirus. But if you're handing out uh, little, you know, cardboard uh, voting uh, preference cards to people, uh, you're probably passing on virus as well. So uh, we're in an unprecedented situation, one that calls, uh, since you've closed down the courts, to close down uh, the Board of Elections and postpone this. That's my take on the trust vote report. Postpone the elections in Ohio and elsewhere. What we need is a fair election, not one that disadvantages one of the three remaining candidates. Good. Now, I can uh, add this in. I want you to um, say something to compel the audience to, to come back, like maybe we'll keep you updated or something along that right. line to, to come back right. to trustvote.tv. Make sure you check in on TrustVote TV. We'll be updating you uh, as these new unprecedented policies unfold. TrustVote TV.